All right, we got Toad versus <laughs> Toad and Toad Hat versus the Ice Climbers. My friend Shay said he uh, he went to Pound and he played Icy's for the first time in his life on stream and he struck the FD. Yo, we are in Wave Dash Down Smash Wars. Nana cannot save Popo. It's actually over for the stock. Never mind. I, j I jinxed so hard. Banana will recover. Meanwhile, uh, the other Nana was a bit too, a bit too low of a percent to save Popo by being knocked back similarly far. The double back air. All right, evened up, evened up. The Ice Climber players will frequently do, oh wow, will frequently do Squall Hammer from Respawn because it keeps Nana in sync so that she doesn't like taunt or something or be dumb on the platform. I do Squall Hammer because it's a fun move. Alright, so we're all just going to be killing ourselves this game, I guess. Everyone's on suicide watch. <sighs> that was a disaster. Yeah, we're just uh, whacking on the yellow stick at the moment. Okay, so... <laughs> I'm sorry, I, I really don't know what to say <laughs> when people are jumping into down smashes and wave dashing into down smashes. And we're actually truly even now because no one got hit. Well, now the other hand is hit. Huh, so one of the F smashes clanked and the other just continued on and hit. Well, Nana didn't feel like living. Oh, that was actually... <laughs> that was too good. There's no way that Miyugi could have gone to the ledge to make Nana recover. More messy, just throwing out smash attack. Had her in a stranglehold. Alright. Miyugi, and a lot of players in general, like to uh, do jab down smash, and she's been representing that a little bit now. The thing is, without Nana to do the second jab, you can just crouch cancel the jab to infinity and down smash her back. Good uh, first game to cut. I'm sorry, Toad. Stage selected. Now. Dang. Now? The counter pick. Miyugi going for the grimy blue hexagon, probably. Yeah, we already have some blue hexagons. Shine just knocks you back so far, and since it has set knockback, it's like... It's like Fox is dead, because Fox didn't recover. 
high enough. We got buffer spot dodges. We got Skeet Blaster. That is the key to just uh, use the fact that Shine doesn't actually have all that much range and space out a stronger move to punish Fox before he actually gets in. Or in hopes that they miss because uh, they're undershooting the Shine because they were expecting you to be in a different spot but you backed up. Or you could just run at Fox and grab him, I guess. But that's risky. Is this best of three? I'm not sure. The way you said that was so convincing. I'm not sure. <laughs> Get up a deck, net play special. The cup's just staying outside of the range of Miyugi's approaches and hitting her for coming in. Dash attack could have been punished, but Cup is looking for the death right there. Invincible Nana during uh, Belay, however you pronounce it. Just runs fast and down smashes. Is that the set? If not, incoming Mugi Ness counter pick. Nah. All right, going back to doubles. Back throw down smash is a staple in the matchup, but the knockback was weird there. It's like they hit one of the climbers the wrong way, so they couldn't down smash them. Good on Cup to realize that that was not his Nana. <laughs> Misses the wave dash out of shield, but that's okay because we know how to we know how to microwave. It. Pretty preemptive on the up smash. First suck to Mugi. The reverse hit box of silliness. Good light shield to make sure that didn't hit Nana. You are not living through the double bear at 140. Isn't the what standard what resolution happen there? for 1080 dimensions like 1920 by 1080? Isn't the what, huh? Isn't it 1920 by 1080? I I'm sorry, I'm just watching... Uh... Two Eskimos beat up on a third one. One of them's just holding their hammer back, though. <clears throat> they don't want to be that brutal, bashing their skull in or whatever. <laughs> Alright, good zoning with auto cancel there to stop them from just coming in with smashes, but uh, F smash could still outrange it.
Well, rip Nana. Rip the Nanas. Okay, they're just hoping that eventually they hit past the shield. Lots of, we'll say, down smash dynamics here. We're seeing the power of down smash as a get off me move, so they wave dash in to punish your down smash and they get down smash. We're seeing it as a move to punish other people who just down smash shield. <laughs> like, I think it's much more powerful for the get off me sense to just double down smash in place when you have Nana, because if the second Nana hit, hits their shield, then, uh,. This is some heavy percent. No, Nana's too smart. Hoping that Cup wouldn't just jump, goes for the down smash. All right, Cup takes it 3-0. Maybe it's a seven. Maybe she was distracted by his 